What's up, NMS? This is Gabe. And Gavin, reporting for your WNMS broadcast today. It's National High Five Day. Try and do a better high five than we just did. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The Nova Middle School Theater Company is pleased to announce that they have one more show. That's right, a third show. Tryouts are on Monday for actors and Tuesday for tech and crew. Audition packets are available in the main office. The forms must be completed in order to try out next week. If you are looking for some added theatrical entertainment, the high school's production of Cinderella is tonight, tomorrow, and Saturday at 7 p.m. at the high school auditorium. Come out for a great night of music and entertainment. On April 27th and 28th, the 7th grade students will be taking part in the M-STEP in the areas of English and Math, and the 8th grade students will be taking part in the M-STEP in the areas of Science and Social Studies. Students will have an altered daily schedule on those days, allowing them to test in the morning and attend classes in the afternoon. Students are reminded about, fo about the following expectations. No cell phones out in school once the school day begins. Continued violations will garner a referral to the office, and hoods should not be up. NMS prom trial to be held from May 5th to 6th in the auxiliary gym from 6 to 8 p.m. Superhero movies have been, a, have been a huge deal since the release of the original Batman movie starring My, Michael Keaton in 1989. DC has released many more Batman movies while Marvel blew audiences away with Infinity War and Endgame. Are the two companies equal? Ava and Sophia investigated. Marvel movies versus DC movies the great debate that will go down in history. These are the makers of the most popular superhero movies. To investigate, Ava and I gathered some local superhero insight. On a Google survey we sent out, most people really love those heroes. We were also curious as to if students would seize the opportunity of becoming a real, full-fledged superhero. Here are a few student responses. As you can see, people have mixed opinions. That wasn't enough for us, though. What superhero movie do people like the best? My favorite superhero movie are the Iron Man movies. Um, I would say it's probably like an Avengers movie, probably like the Infinity War. Me and my dad and my sister, we always watch, watch them on Disney Plus. Because there was like a lot of action in it. Along with like a lot of magic and like the sound effects were really good. DC movies or Marvel movies? I prefer Marvel. Easily Marvel because the superheroes are better. I think Marvel's like more well known or something. So, what do you pick? Maybe you're torn? Regardless of your choice, please respect other people's opinions. This has been Ava and Sophia signing off for WNMS. I'm Batman. We really don't have to pick just one genre, DC or Marvel. DC. If you're into hero films, TV shows, or even comics, both companies have a lot to offer to audiences. Ava has your headline news. Hello, this is Ava with your headline news. Hundreds of homes near Flagstaff, Arizona have been evacuated as a fast-moving wildfire threatened hundreds of structures. About 14 miles northeast of Flagstaff, the tunnel fire located in Arizona's Coconino County had burned more than 16,600 acres as of Wednesday morning. The fire was moving at rapid speeds as 766 households were evacuated, along with more than 1,000 animals. This has been Ava with your headline news. This is Toysha with your Wildcat Sports Wrap. Congratulations to the girls' soccer team on their victory yesterday against Covington Middle School, 2-1. Goals were scored by Manasa Nicola Metla and Miono Jumeda. The Novi Middle School track team did phenomenal last night. They had an extremely close meet against Scranton, which is probably the hardest opponent of the season. Coaches from both schools are still going over the events to determine the winner. What we do know is the field event teams did extremely well. In the long jump, the Novi boys took 
first, second, and third for the clean sweep with Jalen Lillard in that third spot, Gabe Barkis in second, and Timmy Reeves having one of the best jumps Mr. Bronson has ever seen out of a middle schooler for first place. Isabel Armstrong is continuing off of her amazing season last year by taking first in the long jump as well as the 100 meter dash. The boys' high jump went exactly like the long jump. Noah took first, second, and third with the same guys winning. Jalen third, Gabe second, and Tim once again with a very impressive first. Other specific events the team won were the 100 meter boys and girls, 70 meter, 55 meter hurdles, the mile run, and the 400 meter boys. More to come up about this awesome meet soon. Good luck to the softball team as they travel to Oxford to take on Anderson Middle School. The Tigers lost to the Yankees again last night, 5-3. to three. Winners in the NBA playoffs last night were the Celtics, 76ers, and the Bulls. Sophia has the Today in History moment. Hey, NMS. I'm Sophia with a Today in History moment for April 21st. On this day in 2016, music legend Prince was found dead in his Minnesota home. The cause of death was an accidental fentanyl overdose, and millions of people around the world were shocked at the tragic loss of such an icon. In his 40-year career as a musician, Prince made more than 30 albums, even winning seven Grammy Awards. All of this in mind, let Prince be remembered for his great contribution to the music industry and the world as a whole. This has been Sophia with your Today in History moment. Hi, I'm Shreya with your weather for April 21st. Today, there will be a high of 63 and a low of 38. Today will be partly cloudy with a slight chance of rain. Gear up for the upcoming warm weather. Happy birthday to the following students. Happy birthday to you. Clap, clap, clap. Happy birthday. Clap, clap. Did you know today is also National Long Word Day? Did you know this word, Numenultra Microscopic Silico Volcano Coniosis? Because that's a word. This is Gavin. And Gabe, signing off. Have a good Have day, day NMS. <laughs> I'm Batman. We really don't have to pick just one genre, DC or Marvel. DC. If you're into hero films and TV shows, comics, or... <laughs> you messed that one up.